स्टार्ट आई मे ड्रॉ द अटेंशन ऑफ द हाउस टू अ स्पेशल फीचर ऑफ द बजेट एंड इट इज दिस विद ऑल दी हैवी एक्सपेंडिचर ऑन डिफेंस टू द ट्यून ऑफ थर्टी परसेंट द डेवलपमेंटल एक्टिविटी हैज नॉट बीन स्लोड डाउन टूडे वी आर स्पेंडिंग अबाउट नाइनटीन परसेंट ऑन द डिफरेंट डेवलपमेंट एक्टिविटीज बट इन दिस रिस्पेक्ट आई वुड लाइक टू सबमिट दैट द एलोकेशन फॉर एजुकेशन इन दी बजट कॉन्टिन्यूज टू बी एट टू टू थ्री परसेंट आई थिंक एजुकेशन इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सब्जेक्ट एज इट अफेक्ट्स द माइंड ऑफ अवर यंगर जनरेशन एंड इट गिव्स अस द नेसेसरी टेक्निकल पर्सोनल हु आर सो टू से द हैंड्स एंड फीट of our development what we find here is that instead of making an increase in this particular direction on education we are keeping it at the same level i would submit that the finance minister should give his due consideration for increasing the budget on education now i turn to the performance and the working of the ministries i would like to say something first about the work that the planning commission is doing of course the planning commission is doing an excellent work it is at present preparing the fourth five year plan not only that it is preparing a perspective plan for in for a number of years it is also giving a vision it is also suggesting certain priorities in so far as the progress of our country is concerned the planning commission is also carrying out different kinds of studies and researches but at the same time what i feel is that the commission must apply itself also to the weaker sections of the society namely the landless laborers the artisans and those who are living in the rural areas it must also apply itself as to how the weaker areas or the underdeveloped areas in our country can be helped i know that planning commission has prepared certain indicators and has asked the state governments to show which are the regions which are under developed according to the indicators but that much of attention will not do we have to give more attention because if such areas continue so in the different states in our country it will hamper the general progress of the country from the questions that are asked in this house the minister will know the anxiety amongst the members so i would suggest for the consideration of the minister that a special wing be established in the planning commission to study and prepare schemes for such reasons today only seven states have informed as per indicators about these reasons and even then i would submit that a special wing may be constituted in the planning commission to study and prepare schemes for such reasons this wing should not merely prepare schemes but it must at the same time also watch the implementation of the scheme that are meant for such reasons the planning commission must direct 
that a special provision be made and priority given to all the schemes for such reasons the economic development of such a region depends upon the building up of economic overheads in that particular region and you will find as i have given certain things figures that in so far as marathawada area is concerned there is lack of such economic overheads therefore industries are not coming up and since industries are not coming up other developments are also falling short so i would request that consideration may be given to constituting a special wing in the planning commission for the under developed areas coming to the ministry of education what i find is that the ministry of education has been going after too many things it is going after too many changes and also too many experimentations i think the time has come when we should stop this policy of going after too many changes and too many experimentations in the field of education it is because of this that we are not been able to achieve after 18 years of freedom a common pattern throughout the country i think a plea has already been made by a lady member about the pattern different patterns exist in different states of our country one does not know what has happened to the educational objectives that have been incorporated in the different reports with regard to primary education secondary education and college education nobody has tried to peruse as to how far the educational objectives that have been incorporated in these reports have been put through in the different states as far as i know basic education is not being worked in the spirit in which it ought to be and there are different misconceptions about it so it should be seen by the education ministry that instead of going after too many changes and too many experimentations they concentrate and see that at least a common pattern of education at the primary level the secondary level and the college level is evolved throughout the country